welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do something super fun with Gigi. <laughs> we are gonna make uh, Christmas cookies, but we are gonna make them from scratch. So guys, I have everything laid down over here that I will need to make my cookies from scratch. So guys, if you're interested in knowing how to make Christmas cookies, keep watching. All right, so the first step is one cup of butter. So, um, also, like, no fake butter, like, butter, straight up butter. Yeah, yeah, yeah straight up butter, straight up butter. So, this is straight up butter. So, I chose unsalted butter, obviously. Gonna put all of these in my bowl. All right, guys, so I'm gonna put this in the microwave for a couple seconds just to melt the butter a little bit down. All right, guys, so my melted butter is over here. It's not all the way melted, but it's melted, and I put it in the microwave for 30 seconds, but it's because my microwave is not high quality. So if you have a high quality microwave, just put it inside for like 10 seconds. I did the mistake to put this in the microwave and you shouldn't. So I put it, put the butter in this little bowl and put it in the microwave like that. All right guys, so now that our butter is in the bowl and it's a little bit melted, we are gonna beat the butter first before we add the sugar inside. And it has to be low speed. <laughs> You have to beat it until it's creamy. Alright. So our butter looks like cream. Now we are going to add a half a cup of sugar. Now you want to add one tablespoon of vanilla extract. Mine is just from Kroger. You can choose whichever one you want. That add this. So now we're gonna add three cups of all-purpose flour. All right guys, so now I have my three cups of all-purpose flour in here. And then now we're gonna add half of a tablespoon of baking soda. And lastly, we're gonna add one egg. So now we're gonna mix everything together. So I'm gonna add one more egg because my egg was actually really small and I feel like the consistency is not thicker enough. Mm -hmm. So I feel like one egg would probably help the situation. Okay, so you guys, so this is what it's supposed to look like and now we're going to divide it in four and place it in a plastic wrap. So let's get this ready. Thank you. 
one day, which I am today, but I'm using it now. And I've been having it for a while. Alrighty, so I don't know if you can see, but my dough is laid on flat. And I have a bunch of cookie cutters. I bought all these cookie cutters on Amazon. I will link them down below. They're such a shape. It was pretty cheap too. But I'll link everything down below in my description so you can like and purchase it if you ever want to. Christmas on it to put the cookies individually inside and I'm gonna give them to family and friends so yeah it's just a little extra thing that I wanted to add all right guys so that is it for today I hope you guys like this video it took me a long time to do the icing because you have to be very precise don't judge me when I'm gonna show you what my cookies look like because it was hard but at least I tried it and I did it and I'm really proud of myself so I'm excited to show you guys my results let me know in the comments down below if you guys ever made homemade cookies guys don't forget to like share comment down below i'm gonna show you guys right now the results so that's it have a good day bye guys